after those two 18-year-old students involved in Thursday's incident were in court this afternoon facing charges of second-degree assault and disrupting school activities. Meanwhile, there are calls to beef up security here at Perry Hall. Our exclusive video of two fights this week on the campus of Perry Hall High School caught the attention of a concerned alumni and county councilman. I'm very angry. I'm frustrated. I share the concerns of so many parents. David Marks says that he's determined to see immediate changes made at the school. For starters, he's calling for more of a police presence at the largest high school in Baltimore County. I would love to see staffing for an additional school resource officer, um, and I would like to see um, uh, certainly Baltimore County Public Schools uh, engaging the, the parents a little bit more. However, no speaker substitutions will be allowed. Baltimore County School Board President Julie Hen shared similar concerns. She's also speaking out on the disruptions at Perry Hall High. In a statement, she said she will be asking our policy review committee to prioritize a comprehensive review of our student behavior policies. What's in place is not working. We can do better. We must do better. In the meantime, the school administration says it's committed to keeping the campus safe for students and staff members. Now, to comment unrelated to the Thursday incident here at Perry Hall, School Superintendent Dr. Darrell Williams praised school resource officers for building strong relationships with students. Live at Perry Hall High School in Baltimore County, Tim Tutin, WBAL, TV 11 News.